Hi right, everyone, well, and welcome back to Pokemon Down and Pearl. In the last episode, we took on the gym leader Fantine, a ghost type gym leader. But in, in this episode, instead of carrying on with the main story, I want to show you all of the, well, most of the places we can explore now. We have Surf. Uh, probably, we'll probably get through all this in like two episodes. But, um, yeah, let's just show you what you can do um, from the start of the game to the end. Well, not the end, but the point we're at now. So, obviously, he has nothing to do. Why don't you say hi to our mom? Since we are here, might as well say hello. Come on, Jamie, are you a Pokemon Day? Oh, hi, Jamie. So basically, just just bust the uh, only problem. But in platinum, I'm pretty sure you can actually talk to her and she says some stuff instead of just telling your Pokemon as well. But here at the very lake front, there's all the lake here, but we can't use surfing it just yet. But the water's too low, but it'll higher up um, soon, so. There's magically more water gets poured into there, and then boom, we can surf. <laughs> but, I don't really want to be running into wild Pokemon, so. We've got like, yeah, I was going to say, we have like a lot of super repels. Not a max repel. Not a repel, but it's a super repel. Here in Sand Gem Town, if you come over here, you lose all that. I want to say that to the n until the next episode, just for um, the next episode, the time I've planned. Just thinking about it now. If I do all this and then go to the do a bit of the story, then yeah, um, that's about it for now. Um, Okay, so over to Juba Life we go. So over to the left, where um, you originally got the old run over there. You can. Um, that's where you carry on with the story. So I'm not going to do that just yet, but I do want to do something, which is. Oh. Not the repair wearing off, no. <laughs> That's just a coincidence, okay? But over here. Come on, but let's go for a surf. Wow, we do go pretty slow. <laughs> but in platinum, you go a, a bit quicker, but. Put the HP up. Woohoo! <laughs> so. Yeah, that's the item you can get there. All boats is in no water. But. The main thing we're going to be doing in today's episode and the probably most helpful thing you'll find because you can get a lot of so far surfing you can actually miss out half of this, half of this stuff um, your main uh, play for the game if so you didn't watch this episode so lucky you <laughs> um, so here off to the right, oh god, we haven't played Diamond and Pearl in a while to... Remember, I don't remember the surf being this slow, come on. <laughs> Here's the TM24 for Thunderbolt. I do recommend you give this to your electric type. If you don't have an electric type like me, I, I mean, I could give it to my Kadabra, but just because it's Thunderbolt, um, I'm going to keep it for now. Um, because we have Shockwave, so that'll be good enough for now. But maybe later on I'll replace it for Thunderbolt. But as we slowly surf along, I'll I guess I'll tell you um, where we're we going. We're going to a place called the Fuego uh, Ironworks, I believe. I think the Fuego Plateau. But well, I don't even know what that is. <laughs> yeah, it's the Ironworks. So just before we go into the main building, here, still a part of Floroma Town, but this Floroma Meadows. So there's a bunch of items here. Like there's a revive. 
it's probably an item. Yep. Max Repel. Here's just a random Pokeball there. Leaf Stone. Okay, so here's a funny. I don't think there's any Pokemon in the main game really that evolved by Leaf Stones. I'll probably forget it's someone, but. Uh, where else? Probably here? Yep, might be Potion. Oh, I see a spot. Probably here. Yep, honey. Because we are next to Floromatane, so. We're gonna get a lot of this stuff. I guess we already got that one, maybe. I don't know. Miracle Seed, power up your grass type moves in a pinch. <laughs> Wait. Oh, no. Looks like that's all the items. Uh, as long as. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we had that. And yeah, okay. Just checking. <laughs> so. Let's go to the Fuego Ironworks. At the at the end of this adventure, going through the Fuego Ironwork is definitely worth it, as you get one of the most powerful, the most useful fire type moves you've you've ever seen or used if you've used it before. <laughs> Here we go, Weeperberry. I think that's Weeperberry. <laughs> Uh, oh god. No, no, okay. So, this one's a healthy berry. Just to be extra sure about what a Pokemon. <laughs> I, mean, I don't have to worry about running out of repel, so I might as well. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's an item at the back of here. Oh, really? Is there really nothing? Okay, that just seems a bit odd. <laughs> but here's the way your iron works. Now, as you can see, you have these like little panels here which will stop you from um, moving in other directions than the where, um, arrow it's pointing to. So, yeah, it's going to be a bit confusing. Yeah, um, these, what's called, workers. Use fire type Pokemon like Ponyta, Rapidash, pretty much just that. <laughs> well, in Dominant Pearl, that's pretty much the only ones, but in. If you play in Platinum, they'll have Magmars and even Magnemites. Not fire type Pokemon, but that's the Pokemon you'd expect to work to have, really. It's a magnet. <laughs> Never know when a magnet could come useful. Other than sticking it on your fridge. <laughs> Sticking it? Is that the right word to put on it? Uh. Uh, there we go. Oh yeah, they also have my chops, so... We should have my chokes as well. I think so. But anyways, the chop goes down. Level 31. Because, yeah, these... Now we've got Surf, we're accessing these areas. I, I say access them now. It gives you Pokemon uh, a lot more experience, ready for the what's to come next on the adventure. As if you come later on, it'll give you experience that could be a bit useful, but not as useful as it could have been if you'd done it now, if you know what I mean. So, yeah, do recommend versing the trainers. As in the last episode, I weren't trained up, so I've done a little bit more training up, and then, yeah. But I'm gonna take Blimpy out of the front. But yeah, I was worried about ha them having the choke, so. Oh, we drive good level 28. Work at Dylan. Or Dylan. I burned out. Let's change. Aimbot. Wait, what are the items that we're holding? So we fight amulet coin. Okay. So it's good um, Aimbot has the amulet coin on now since he's in front. Or she. I'm pretty sure it's a he. Yeah. I was just checking. <laughs> um. Okay. Let's have a guess. 
Oh, no, I'm not really. I'm gonna guess because we're going this way now. Oh, this is a burn hill. Oh, it's pretty self explanatory. Go heal the burn. <laughs> Full heal. Heals any status move. There you go. <laughs> Saves you from buying it from the shops. <laughs> But it's pretty good that you don't actually find wall Pokemon in here, so you don't need to use Repel. I have one activated because, you know, we went through um, the grass to get here. Uh, okay. Yeah, you know, I'm just going to versus for experience. Why not? Well, it's not often we get a visitor like you to the Ironworks. Let's mark the occasion with a battle. Is this the new Pokemon? No, oh, yes, it's a new Pokemon. This is the evolution of the Pokemon Onyx. Pretty speedy little dude. It'll get destroyed by a water type move. So, I'm about you, Surf. <laughs> it's Steel type, which is the type that resists the most. Let's let's see what what types it resists. I'm probably going to get a couple wrong. Psychic Dark in this generation, yes. In uh, Gen 6 onwards, it doesn't. But, um, not Psychic. Dark Ghost, that's it, not Psychic. Grass, Bug, Dark. Um, I already said Dark, pretty sure. But there are some more. Um, but that's the evolution of Onyx, but to evolve him into Onyx? Is see you could just hit that and go back to the beginning. So I remember coming here in here as a kid oh, when I was little. First going through, weren't too difficult. I mean, I I kind of got the puzzle. I'm pretty sure I went through on my main adventure. But here, I was gonna say he's gonna be an item, but in this. No, that's like twice the episode I thought there was going to be an item. Actually, probably more than twice. <laughs> uh, okay, yes. That is free to go. Pretty sure this item up here is... Yeah, we can run in here. Oh, it's just... Yeah, it's Firestone. I thought so. But that's not going to be useful at all in your main adventure. Uh, okay, so... This bit, you gotta look carefully on which path you want to choose. So, that sends through there. How do, how do I get this item? Oh, I do not want to go down. Okay, not the bottom. Middle. Could be. Okay, I'm just going around for the top. I. Uh, yes, okay. It's just because I wanted this item. Because it's a rocking tan. So I actually didn't know. <laughs> I just wanted it because you know it's a pokeball. Oh, it's an item. Why wouldn't you want an item? It's free. <laughs> Are you ever getting annoyed by where the floor panels take you? Not really. <laughs> I'm not dumb. I'm pretty smart when it comes to speed panels. <laughs> this isn't the only game where this uh, the speed panels were. This guy's a hacker! He's a cheat! Why well, my brother would say, HACKER! HACKER! KICK HIM! No! I never play Halo, I always say that, but... Or any shooting game or anything they get killed in. They just say they're hacking. But... Here yeah, is Rapidash. Um, it's the evolution of Ponyta, as you can probably already tell. I mean, it's more of a unicorn. <laughs> I don't have thought of being a unicorn, but... It kind of does look like one with that huge horn, but I'm on Danny Flames. Pony 2 evolves at level 40, and he has a level 33 Rapidash, but it makes sense. It's better than him having literally a level 40 Rapidash and then just destroying you. But let's go get this item, which is TN35 Flamethrower, which is the reason you came here. Maybe look at this guy, and you could even miss out on this item, but it's a Fuego. Well, hello! It's not often I get a visit here. I tried to make the ironworks run better with the moving floor tiles. But I was happy about it. They said the moving floor made them dizzy. 
but you don't want to listen to me, me whine, here's a souvenir. So yeah, we get another fire star. Yeah, you know, just in case you need items that you don't want. <laughs> in um, platinum, that should be pretty useful though. Okay, so then we came here. Dun, dun. <laughs> Let's go to uh, Eternity. Won't have anything, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I don't want anything. Our home. No. I was gonna say this is where we need to go. So we go here anyway, but just in case, because we're doing it in order. Here we go. This is something that I think everyone's gonna be happy about. If you come over here. And oh, 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 before I surf here, oh, there's a citrus berry here. Must have been growing them. Because I took the other two items, so yeah. Citrus and a palmeg berry. Palmedge? Probably palmeg. I'm not a farmer, not a berry expert. Like you watching, maybe. <laughs> okay, so. Eh. Here is a rare candy. You're gonna level up your Pokemon up once. So, uh, you know, why not use it on Kinesis? He's literally just got to level 32. Let's just go for it. Because why not? Really? It's, it's an extra level. Why not? Bam! Level 33. Oh. Okay, so oh yes, Pastoria this is where we shall be going next. Let's go, Blimpy! Woohoo! Kind of fall. It sounds kind of weird that we're flying on a huge balloon. <laughs> so if you come out here and you surf, you'll see a bunch of boats. Yeah, they they don't want to use rocks to um, stop you from going here. Oh, I just remembered one item we can get now as well. Uh, not this item, but this is the Mystic Water. Pairing up your water type moves. So, might as well put that on Aimbot. Yeah, the amulet coin could be useful, but it will be alright for now. So, an item. So, if we go back to Heart Arm City, and we go over to the right, there is, if you remember, next to a Pikachu girl, there's a bunch of water and a rock that looks like we can actually surf behind. So, as you probably guessed, that's where we're going. So, let's go. There's the Pikachu girl. So, oh yes, we can indeed surf behind it. So, let's go for a... Repel, obviously. No, the Super Repel! <laughs> As we slowly surf, it's a Grass type TM. Which is TM19 Giga Drain. Better than Mega Drain in some ways. It's got like 80 power, I believe. Mega Drain's like 50 or 60. But it's got less PP, so for now, I think I'll be good. But later on, I'll probably end up replacing it for Giga Drain. Um, but yeah, and that's it for this episode. This is probably a bit. Uh, being a little bit shorter than the rest, but you know, no biggie, no biggie. Uh, in the next episode, we're going back to Salai San Gem Town, <laughs> not Salacia. San Gem Town. I've always got those two mixed up a little, but 
Yeah, we're going back to San Gem Town and surfing through Route 219, Route 20, and then making it to Route 21 and exploring, battling a bunch of trainers, and then going back to Jubilife City and surfing over to Canalife City. So if you're excited for that, let me know and I'll see you next time.